Hey, it's April from the Noble Garden and I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about my chickens today. So this is Georgia and Gladys. I got these from a Facebook swap along with another one named Ginger who lives in my house on December 17th. Um, three weeks after I got them, the one that lives in my house, Ginger, started showing signs of a respiratory infection. Sneezing and wheezing is what she was doing. And I've been watching them since. I finally decided to take them to the vet yesterday and she thinks they do obviously have a respiratory infection, so she's giving them antibiotic water or antibiotics and I had to put it in their water, which is a bummer for me because the little brown one, my Gladys, she's been giving us an egg almost every day and we're not going to be able to eat her eggs for 10 weeks because of the antibiotics. Um, she just thinks that if, Glad if Ginger's this sick, then the others have it and don't want to take any risks to try to get them better. Our plan is to add about four more birds to the um, group. But we gotta get these healed and better first. I did test them for microplasma, um, and they came back negative, so that's a positive thing. Because if you know anything about microplasma, they have that, then they can pass it to birds, and your flock will always have it. There is a chance that they still got something that the flock will always have, and it's gonna be in my flock. But I'm not gonna sell my birds, I'm not gonna give my birds away. They're my birds, and if they do have this disease, then I will deal with it. Um, this is not their permanent home, this is a borrowed coop. We are actually working on their coop this weekend, and this is a very ghetto, put today, put together in one day coop uh, run that I we plan on switching. Right now, they're eating scratch and mealworms that the girls decided to give them. Um, let's go in and see Ginger, my sick chicken. Before we go see Ginger, I decided to show you guys as Gladys's beautiful brown eggs. This is before the antibiotics, so we're allowed to eat them. We're actually going to have breakfast for dinner tonight. Um, we're really, really sad because we've really been enjoying Gladys's eggs. Ginger and Georgia have not laid for us yet. It is winter. It's very common for chickens not to lay. Um, so I'm not trying to worry about that right now. I'm just worried about trying to get them better. So let's see Ginger. So this is Ginger. As I was telling you, my sick bird that lives in my bathroom. She's been living in that box, but as she's getting better, she's climbing out of it. Take a listen to her. So that's kind of what she's been doing for over a month now. Um, she does look better than she has. She um, started her antibiotic water this morning. And they also have her on an anti-inflammatory to help her with her swollen um, trachea. Um, thank you for watching. I'll keep you updated on Ginger's status.